Welcome back, everyone. A lot of surgery. So in the world of digital deformities, we have the hammer toe. Um, and we also have something that's called a mallet toe. A lot of people suffer from this deformity. Um, the, the hammer toe, historically, this is what it looks like, right? Uh, the deformity is at the level of the proximal or distal interphalangeal joint. A mallet toe is basically this, where the tip of the toe is looking downwards. And the problem becomes, and again, we're not going to talk about whether it's a flexible deformity, a semi-rigid or a rigid, but what eventually happens is that the patient starts to walk on the tip of the toe. And that creates a lot of pain. Um, luckily, this patient has not developed um, any type of ulceration okay, on the tip of the toe, which, uh, which uh, happens a lot. So what we're doing here is not only uh, addressing the functional element, but prophylactically, we, we are avoiding any future issues or any future problems. So we're going to go ahead and show you uh, the entire world, right? Um, how do we correct these deformities here in our office? The patient is wide awake, local anesthesia, and it really is, a, it really is a, an extremely effective procedure. So without further ado, um, let's commence. Okay, so everyone, um, you know, the, the, the beautiful thing about, again, these, uh, f what we call a flexor tenotomy, um, is that it's a one stitch procedure. So, you know, what we first do is we make a little incision, just like that. And again, the flexor tendons are the ones that flex the toe down. And what we're essentially doing now is we're, we're looking, right? We know exactly where we are. And we're transecting, we're cutting those tendons, bingo, just like that. Did you guys wow. see that? Did you, well, one second. Did you guys just see what happened? The toe is now, went from that to that. That's wow. how powerful the deformity is, right? So let's go now to the third toe. Little, a little, oh, there it is. We go in, identify the two important tendons and Bingo. Voila. Wow. I mean, are you guys, I mean, this is like, it's, it's not magic. You know, now we're going to the four toe. Mm. Little incision. And as you can see, the left, the left hand, I want to, I want to, oh, that's it. But before anything, the left hand, I would like, you know, we hold the toe mm -hmm. this way, right? And once you transect that tendon, it just gives. What do I mean, Dr. Weiner? What do you mean by that, that it gives? The toe was begging for us to do this, right? The toes, all the tendons were so contracted. And all of a sudden now, in less than three minutes, all the deformities have been corrected. Um. And... You know, now what we do, Dr. Weiner, not, so what happens now? So we, for, during the course of the next several weeks, we're going to go ahead and splint, right? Keep the toes nice and straight to make sure that they don't, you know, I've always said that toes have a mind of their own, that they don't kind of go like this again. So we're just going to keep them nice and straight. Uh, the patient will definitely, you know, patient walks in, patient walks out. Uh, patient will be able to, to go back to daily life activities. No problem. If anyone is thinking, well, Dr. Wagner, what about the fifth toe, right? It looks like it's kind of going a little bit underneath. Um, you know, my recommendation is to maybe also do the, the fifth toe, okay? Because eventually it's gonna, it's gonna, you know, well, once this is, once the fourth toe is aligned, there you go, that's pretty much what we, we, we can definitely release also this one and it'll be right there. So we're gonna go ahead and also do the fifth. Okay, let's go ahead.
Oh my gosh. Wow. So now we're going to go ahead and uh, address the deformity again, same thing on the great toe. Go in, little stab incision, and just like that, boom, right there. You guys probably just saw how the how the gray toe just clicked up. Mm -hmm. There it is again. I can actually hear it. You guys can't over there. Maybe you can, but... You know, the beautiful thing about, about MIS, minimally... And look at that. Just look at that, right? Right? Five toes, five-minute procedure. Um, just extremely effective. And now, when we look at the, the foot, even from the side, even from the top, I mean, uh, the patient, I suspect, is probably thinking, well, what about my right foot, right? Um, but that's not going to happen. Okay, so, you know, just another view from the top. Everything is, uh, looks beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. True definition of uh, transformation. Yeah. This is absolutely wonderful. I mean, when we talk about these these uh, these percutaneous, uh, I mean, it just doesn't get any better than this. No outpatient surgery center, no hospital. Patient is again wide awake. This is absolutely wonderful. Function, beauty, right? We'll throw the beauty in there. Function, beauty and prophylactic prevent a problem before it becomes one i hope everyone has enjoyed this video as always have a wonderful day this is amazing i can't believe my toes look normal now so it's incredible. you know the patient actually wanted to say something so we get we gave the you know we gave the patient kind of like the microphone right so how did it go it went great. It didn't hurt. It was fast. I mean, immediate. My toes just sprung up. And, uh... Like, it, just like that, right? Just like that. They sprung up. That's... And they look great. You know, we truly love what we do. Look at that. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not magic, I promise you. We have not done anything, uh, we did not edit this whatsoever. No, but it looks like magic. <laughs> okay. Anything else you want to say to the world? I love my toes. I love mytoes.com. <laughs> have a wonderful day.